Coming off of a 56-52 win over Eastern Illinois on the road, the Austin P. Governors now return home for five straight, starting with Moorhead State and Southeast Missouri. Hello, everyone. I'm David Luce, joined now by head coach Dave Luce. And the Governors do come off of that 56-52 win in Charleston, Illinois. And now your team carrying some momentum for a five-game homestand. We needed to win badly. We got it at Eastern Illinois. Our, our press was really effective in the second half. So hopefully our guys can gain some momentum and some confidence going into the game with Moorhead and, and the five-game homestand. You talk about that press defense. This is something you've used to affect uh, in several games this season. Talk about when and how you try and employ it. Well, we pick and choose because we're, uh, you know, we're not playing a, a lot of people right now. The press, uh, if you do it uh, and sustain it, it requires uh, a number of people being being out there playing. So, we pick and choose our times right now. Um, you know, we were uh, we were kind of out of options to be honest at the point. To, we were down nine at the half at Eastern Illinois. Um, Actually, they came out and made the first two buckets of the second half, so we're down 13. That's when we called timeout and, and uh, implemented the press. Now you come home for five straight. Moorhead State up first for the Governors. What do you do this week to make sure that your team carries that momentum into your homestand? Well, I think, first of all, our guys got to understand the mindset of Moorhead State. they they got a great toughness about them. They play hard. They love to play in transition. Uh, so I think they have to understand that, and, and uh, we have to be prepared to uh, answer that. Let's talk about Moorhead State. As the Eagles come into town, you talk about uh, their toughness playing in transition. What else can we expect? Well, Warner is an outstanding player, one of, one of the uh, real good players in our league. Uh, but they've got other guys to go along with him. Uh, you know, Story is a is an experienced uh, point guard who's very aggressive and a, and a tough kid. And uh, you know, Arrington, uh, they, they got good players up and down throughout their lineup. Then on Saturday, Southeast Missouri comes to the Dunn Center, and if you go back to last year, you know you're going to see a team with a lot of talent and a lot of athleticism. Yeah, Bradley, Cleveland, Nino Johnson, all talented guys uh, among the, the more talented guys in the league. Uh, so they can put up points on you. You you, uh, you have to be ready to defend in that game. Bottom line, what are the keys for the governors in these two? Same as always, to take care of the basketball. You know, uh, shot selection is real important. And, of course, we've had a free throw problem uh, rear its ugly head again lately, so we gotta we got to make sure that we guard and, and make some free throws. Well, good luck this week against Moorhead and SEMO. Thanks, Dave. Well, that's head coach Dave Luce. The Austin P. Governors get started on a five-game homestand starting with Moorhead State on Thursday night and Southeast Missouri on Saturday evening. Make sure to keep up with all the action right here at letsgop.com.